All right, welcome to our Optimist Golden Hour. My name is Christine Osterhus, and I am our Collegiate Marketing Manager here at Kendra Scott. Um, one of my favorite parts of my job is to manage our Campus Ambassador Program. This year we have almost 100 ambassadors across 80 campuses, and their job is really to be a megaphone on campus for the brand and really connect us with those local communities through family, fashion, and philanthropy. And I'm so excited to be joined by two of our gems tonight. Um, if you ladies wouldn't mind introducing yourselves. Hannah, if you wanted to go first. Absolutely. My name is Hannah Derrickson. I'm a senior at the University of South Carolina, originally from Delaware, so a little bit far from home, uh, majoring in marketing and minoring in fashion merchandising. And hi, I guess I should say howdy. My name is Jabrion Jackson. I am currently attending Texas A&M University as a senior. I am teaching first graders. They're so fun. Uh, my major is education. So looking forward to that. Okay. Can you both go through and just tell us a little bit about what it's like to be a part of the GEM program? Absolutely. So being a GEM is just the best way to gain any experience you're looking to gain, whether that's merchandising and marketing, um, finance, any of the departments that you are interested in. It's really a program that you can kind of make what you want to be. Um, so as a gem, you are responsible for a few social posts a month, whether those are Instagram stories and feed posts, as well as um, KGBs or Kendrick Gives Back events. So you're able to really kind of get hands on with philanthropic work. Um, you're able to sit in on calls with the marketing team. You're able to um, kind of like really explore what interests you the most. So you are able to take that and run with it for your career. So it's much more than an ambassador program. I would say you get a lot of hands-on experience um, you learn a lot from it and you get to apply that through your events. Mm -hmm. I think my favorite part of the gym program has been how closely we work with everyone in the Kendra Scott family. You know, you could be working with another gym or you could be working with your marketing manager on something that you never thought you would, you know, like these big philanthropic events that are impacting so many people. Definitely. So I know that you both have really exciting things coming up with Kendra Scott. Um, can you tell me a little bit about those? Absolutely. So I am lucky enough to be the merchandising planning and allocation intern this summer with Kendra Scott. Yay. And I am so excited to be helping or having a hand in opening a new pop-up shop in College Station, Texas. I forgot that one as well. We're opening a pop-up shop in Columbia as well. So I'm also helping with the grand opening for that. Love it. So fun. Um, and you know, Obviously, we are in a crazy time, and um, this month, a year ago, our entire world changed, and I think we will all come out of this, you know, as different people than when we started, and knowing that you're both college seniors, can you tell us a little bit how you've been navigating um, the change of, of your senior year during a national pandemic? Yeah, I think that it can be really easy to focus on the things you're missing out on. Um, I know for a lot of us SEC students, that includes football, um, just going into the games, certain aspects like that. I know a lot of social events, in-person classes, everyone has their kind of own experience with what they're missing. Um, so I think really focusing on the time that you've been given. You know, we're not going to every in-person class anymore. We don't have all those responsibilities like we did. So kind of really focusing on what you want to do with that time and how you want to make your senior year be. It's not the normal one, but you're also, I think, given a lot of opportunities to do what you want to do with that time, whether it's spend more time with your friends, focus on those relationships, gain more experience for your career after school. Um, I think really just putting a positive mindset on how you're going to look at the year and what you're going to do with it versus focusing on how different it was in the past three is um, the best outlook that you can have. Mm -hmm. I agree with Hannah. You know, for me personally, there were a lot of things that I was looking forward to in my senior semester. And I guess I, I spent a lot of time trying to figure out how I was still going to do those things um, until I finally got down to the what it was I actually wanted to do, right, and how I was going to get that done. Just really focusing on the why, like maybe I wanted to have an event with my friends, but I can still do that just in a smaller setting um, and make it more intimate. So, you know, having that positive outlook and really I guess projecting that onto my friends or letting my friends project that onto me has really helped this year. Definitely. And, you know, I think the reason I'm so impressed with both of you and your positive attitudes, and I think that's why I'm so excited to be able to talk about our newest product launch with you. Um, so we did just launch our Optimist collection, and this is all about, you know, if this pan, we know we're not on the other side yet, but we're so excited to get there and really focusing on that bright light. And um, this collection is filled with fun colors and 
you know, braided bracelets and beaded bracelets. And um, I just wanted to, you know, hear your thoughts on the collection and talk about it. I know we're all wearing it, so we can talk about how we're styling it. Um, just let me know your thoughts. Jay Ryan, why don't you go first? Yes. Oh my goodness. When I first got this bracelet in the mail, yeah, like literally I'm styling here. I have my like Elton cuff on. I love it so much. I think it's the fact that it's on my wrist and it's a constant reminder. Like whenever I'm feeling down, I'm like, okay, how can I like look at the light, you know, in this situation? Like how can I be optimistic about what's going on right now? Absolutely love it. And I also have the choker on, which is very cute. I don't know if you can see. <laughs> I have a little Optimus choker on. It's very cool. Yeah, I do too. We're twins. <laughs> it's so fun. And I think we're seeing, you know, a big trend in spring is fun colors and bright colors. So I think this goes perfectly along with that. And um, my favorite are the earrings. If you can see the color in them, they're like dainty and small, but they're still such a statement because of the colors. And they just kind of like, you can wear a simple outfit and they kind of bring that light to it, which I think is kind of what the collection is all about. So I think they um, say exactly what they need to in the sense of bringing light to the situation. Definitely. And I think, you know, for me, like, so I wear this, I wear this necklace every day. This is from our fine jewelry collection. And so adding this, which just gives it a little something extra and it's really fun. I love that we all showed up wearing white today. Um, I think we're all ready for spring and for bright colors and, you know, accessorizing in that way. I have, this my bracelet which we all have with my um just some you know some chaos bracelets and a fine ring stack and then i have my optimus bracelet over here um of course with my inheritance of hope bracelet which i always wear which is one of my favorite reminders of of one of the events that we do here at kinder scott um okay so jay brown i love that you said when you look down it's a constant reminder um i think that this like when i think of this it's definitely something that i want to gift it's something that i want to share with my friends um where like what who's the first person you want to buy this for so honestly sometimes my friends and i like if we're ever having a bad day or maybe we just had a test or something we'll do like a little something like we'll just like drop it at their door and knock you know and run away and so this was the first thing i thought of when i got this bracelet in the mail like who can i knock on like when they're having a rainy day and just like leave it there for them so that they can also have a little reminder of like you know let's be optimistic today and like today might be like a rainy day but tomorrow might be a sunny one yeah i would have to say one of my sisters because i'm the oldest of three girls and so we're all going through this year at different stages in our life for example i'm a senior in college she, my sister's a freshman in college and then a sophomore or a sophomore in high school. So, you know, each one of us could have something like, oh, I'm missing this or I missed this. And so I think that we've been able to kind of be constant reminders for each other that we're all are missing something, but it's what you make of it. So I think giving the bracelet to them would be a little good reminder when they need it for something they're, you know, down about. Um, it could be the perfect reminder for that situation. I love that. Um, so we also have, uh, this collection also comes with engravable um, sterling pieces that say Optimus on it, which I love. And then a little bit later, we're going to come out with some really exciting things, which I have in front of me. So we have like this tumbler, got to stay hydrated, you know, got to be healthy. I just started doing a gratitude journal in 2021, um, which perfect. Can you imagine like opening this every morning to write, to start your gratitude journal? I'm so excited about that. We have like fun little keychains. And then also if you're 21, um, a must have wine tumbler, um, obviously. So keep an eye out, these are, these are coming out as well. Um, so uh, lastly, I just wanted to uh, applaud both of you for your positive attitudes. We're so excited to have you as part of the Kinder Scott family. Um, and I'm so glad that we were able to have both of you on to talk about the Optimist collection. Um, I did, want to announce something super fun. So as we continue going, um, you know, through fall 2021, as we're looking at the next school year, we are launching our applications for the GEM program for fall 2021 and spring 2022. Um, those will launch at the end of April. So keep an eye out. You can look at kendrascott.com backslash gems for more information. We will talk about it on our social channels. Um, but I wanted to see if either of you have advice for someone that is looking to apply for this program. Absolutely. First, I want to say that if you, you know, are junior, senior, sophomore in college, and you're kind of worried that you're not, you didn't get that adequate experience this summer during an internship, or you're worried about how you're going to 
get that experience for the real world, this program is the best thing ever because you will get all the experience you need. You will get to sit hand firsthand in meetings and learn from them and kind of just observe. And it has given me so much experience and I feel so much more equipped to kind of um, go head first towards my career and kind of take the knowledge that I've learned and run with it. So um, if you're thinking about applying, really come up with an open mind. No matter what um, department you want to gain experience in, you will be able to get that experience. So it's really for everybody. My biggest piece of advice would be to apply, honestly. So coming in, I was really, really nervous applying. I was like, hey, am, am I good enough? You know, and like, is my channel going to appeal to, you know, certain people? but apply, you know, the quote, I love this quote, I have it on my wall. You are braver than you believe, stronger than you seem, and smarter than you think. Um, apply, you have what it takes, I promise you, put it all down on paper and see what happens, you never know. Perfect, perfect advice. Um, thank you both for your time this evening. And just a reminder for everyone, you can go shop the Optimist Collection now, um, in stores and online, and then keep an eye out for the gem application. Thank, Thank you. you so much for having us, Christine. Yeah, of course.